So as a clinician who's been involved on the adoption side of healthcare technology and now as a consultant who's helping healthcare technology companies implement or have their, their products or services be used by clinicians in the clinic every day, I've come across a few uh, very common barriers to adoption or utilization of technology or products or devices in the clinical setting. And they come in really a couple different forms. The first form is just change in general, right? <laughs> Right? Clinicians are very stuck in their ways a lot of times. They have their, their workflows and they don't like to deviate from them. So unless the product very easily fits into that workflow, a lot of, a lot of clinicians are just like, you know what, I'm not going to use it. So workflows is a big piece. And then the other one is integration or the, the cumbersome nature of having to use more than one tool. So maybe it's logging into different platforms. Maybe it's forgetting a password. How does the data flow? Do they have to copy their information or their notes from one area and put it into another? Like, how does, how does all that work? The way that I've seen that's been successful in getting over this has been, one, consulting with and working with the organization itself to develop those new workflows that integrate that tool, and then staff training and giving them specific examples, specific case uses. In this situation, this is how the tool would be used, or this is how you would just incorporate it into your workflows. 